So here we're going to show a machine that's been badly infected with various hijackers and rootkits uh, being cleaned up by Prevex Edge. Here we can see uh, various pieces of the malware being highlighted. Uh, this machine has about 50 individual pieces of uh, malicious code running on it. I'm going to use uh, hijack this just to show a few more of these entries. Um, we can also see that it's been loaded with a browser hijacker that makes it very hard for users to access security websites in particular to download removal tools and antivirus software. This is a particularly bad infection because um, it's very prevalent out there at the moment and a lot of users are getting hit with this and it's very, very difficult to remove uh, all the, the malicious software in one go. But we'll see how Provex does this. So uh, if a user knew what to look for, he might search on Google for Provex. Uh, he'd get the Google listing for Provex However, when he tries to uh, use Internet Explorer to try and get to our website, the hijacker would divert um, that request to a different site. So it would be virtually impossible to reach the Prevex website or any other security vendor for that matter. So it just you can see it just uh, redirects the search every time. So it works as well with uh, Yahoo search and you'll see there you can't get to the website. So what we've done is we loaded up Opera and uh, luckily this hijacker is not aware of Opera at all. So we managed to download Prevex Edge. And you can see it's 838 kilobytes big. few seconds of downloading and running the installer. Stick in our license key. And there we start the install. Uh, on install it does a quick scan of the machine to identify any running threats. And there we can see that it's found an initial bunch of uh, malware that we're going to block. And then we're going to proceed to clean those threads up. Now it's going to do a full scan. This process takes around 1 minute and 10 seconds. It's identified 24 threats so far and counting 65 and there we go. So all these threats uh, are active on the machine at the moment and we're going to proceed to disinfect them. This process takes around a minute and a half uh, to neutralize and disable all the threats on the machine.
So after the machine has rebooted, we're going to do a quick scan to see if all the threats have been removed on reboot. And we can see that the machine is clean.